The next day I went to learn about space exploration at what has to be one of the most brilliantly designed outside museum spaces with its focus point, this 350 foot titanium rocket. But the star of the show inside the museum is of course, this man. Yuri Gagarin was born in a small Russian village to a carpenter father and a milkmaid mother. Drafted into the Soviet Air Force aged 21, he was selected as one of the 20 outstanding pilots to man the first mission to space. After physical and psychological tests, Gagarin was chosen for his intellect and focus, and particularly noted for his modesty, which may be why he was also the first choice of the other candidates. On the 12th of April 1961, in Soviet Kazakhstan, Gagarin, aged 27, straps himself into the Vostok 1 spacecraft. And at the moment of liftoff, Gagarin famously shouts, Then, for the next 108 minutes, Vostok 1 makes a single orbit around the Earth, and Gagarin becomes the first person to truly see the planet, saying, I see Earth, it is so beautiful. Now descending in just its re-entry capsule known as Little Ball, at 7 kilometers above Earth, Gagarin ejects himself out of the hatch and parachutes into a Russian field, whereupon he explains to the local farmer, don't be afraid, I am a Soviet citizen like you, who is descended from space and I must find a telephone to call Moscow. Gagarin immediately becomes an international celebrity and a Soviet hero, with huge parades not seen in Russia since the victory celebrations of the Second World War. Unwilling to risk the life of the USSR's most popular ambassador, Gagarin is no longer scheduled for space missions. But tragically, seven years later, in 1968, Gagarin dies in a military training flight, aged just 34. Today, every April the 12th, the date Gagarin rocketed into history, is celebrated as Cosmonautics Day in Russia, as International Day of Human Spaceflight by the United Nations, and as Yuri's Night by ordinary people from around the world, who hold what they call a global space party. As one commentator famously summed up, his smile lit up the darkness of the Cold War. Yuri Gagarin, the first man in space, I salute you.